This is the first dog we're going to show you today. You're looking at Sybil. Sybil is down as a shepherd mix, um, five-year-old spayed female, uh, <laughs> loves people. This is just the sweetest dog. She is strangling herself to get close because she is a lover dog. She wants to be petted. She wants to be cuddled. She wants to be loved. She is very energetic, very active. Now, let's see. Can you get her to sit? See if, you, she, see if she'll sit for you. Sit. Would you sit, baby? Sybil, sit. So obviously she's had some training, and she has the beautiful, most beautiful, kindest eyes you'll ever see. This is an energetic, strong, big dog. Probably house trained generally. If people train their dog to sit, they also house break, but do understand that if a dog's been in a shelter, they need to be re-educated. They kind of forget. But she's had some basic training, and she really, really, really wants to please. And her name is Sybil. She is a love. Reddy is a two-year-old neutered male uh, American Staffordshire Terrier. The notorious pit bull. But there's nothing notorious about this guy except that he is this beautiful flaming red color. He is an incredibly sweet dog. He is obviously very food responsive. He's a little bit underweight right now. He needs some, a bunch of food. We don't know whether he was, whether he's house trained or not because he came in as a stray and we don't have any background on him. And you can tell looking at him, you can see his spine, you can see his hip bones. He needs lots, he needs lots of good food and lots of feeding up. But absent that, the tail never stops wagging. The eyes never stop twinkling. This is a dog that's up to play and run and love and be happy all of the time. So if you're up for an energetic, happy, outgoing boy, take a look at Reddy. So if you're up for some real happy puppy play, a dog that will romp and gallop and bounce and jump, <laughs> take a look at Yo Play. Yo Play is a lab mix, mostly lab, he looks like. Uh, very, very happy boy. This is one that you stay out of the way of the tail because it'll whip you. Um, all he wants is people. This dog only, only wants to be around folk. And as you can see, he'll literally climb in your lap. If you're looking for the happiest, the friendliest, the most outgoing sugar pie of a dog with a tail that never stops, this is the original dog that can't hold its liquor because it'll lick you to pieces. Uh, kissing and hugging and loving. He's so happy to be out of the cage and the sadness is that when we finish taping him, back he goes into that cage. So, if you're looking for a good, happy buddy friend and you've got the strength to deal with a highly energetic dog, and remember, it will quiet down once he's not confined in a cage all day, but it's not gonna quiet down a huge amount. This is Play in a Black Wrapper and his name is Yo Play. This little guy is Shaggy. Shaggy is a two-year-old neutered male. He is a terrier mix. We very frankly have no idea what he's mixed with, but he is happy. It could be some Bedlington in him, actually, but we simply don't know. But he is a friendly, secure, happy, outgoing little guy. Uh, oftentimes we see the little ones come in and they're intimidated and they're cowed and they're withdrawn. That is not the case with Shaggy. This is a little dog with a tremendous amount of energy. Again, this is a dog that relates well to people. He is sweet, he is friendly. He's got that coat which probably will not shed. He's going to need to be brushed or he will mat, but he's just darling and when he runs, the, the, the little feathers whip in the breeze. He's, he's just a cutie. He's a, he's a small, cute, happy, friendly little guy and he's looking for someone to take him home and just love him. And we go from little and shaggy to little and naked. This is Maximo. Maximo is only a baby. He's 11 months old. He is a terrier mix, looks like maybe fox terrier or something. But Maximo is a different story than shaggy. Maximo is a frightened, shy dog. We don't know what the world has given him. We don't know what blows this dog has received. We do know that as frightened and as shy as he is, he doesn't bear a tooth, he doesn't growl, he just kind of hunkers back on his hind legs, looks up at you with those big beautiful eyes and says, please, please, please don't hurt me. 
So he needs someone to teach him about loving. He needs someone to teach him that people don't hurt their friends and that homes are forever and, and hearts are for loving and hands are for petting and there is safety and security and love no little kids for this dog only because he's so frightened. Uh, older children I don't think would be a problem, um, but no, nobody who's going to overwhelm him. And if you take the time to just sit and pet him and talk to him and love up to him a little bit, he's going to be all over you. This is a guy who's been through the mill, has come out whole and sweet on the other side, and now needs someone to show him the light and the life that comes after. His name is Maximo. And this little guy is Wombat, and I guess you can tell how he got his name, because he's just a little bit chunky, <laughs> just a little bit. But he is a sweet little boy. He is a Chihuahua or Chihuahua type, about five years old. We suspect that he's never been house trained. A lot of people with these teeny tiny dogs don't even bother. They either litter pan, pan train them um, or they get this artificial lawn that they use as a puppy pooper area because they really don't produce a whole lot of waste. Now again, this guy, if you look at him, is not shaking, is not shivering, is not being shy. The little plumy tail wags. Um, he's very curious. He's into everything. This is a a little boy. This is, this is, this is a hold in your arms and cuddle baby. This is a great dog for a senior who wants a lap companion. This is a great dog for someone who maybe isn't too active and wants a dog, want, wants to have a soul to share life with. Wombat only wants to do that. He only wants to share his heart with someone who will love him forever. And he's waiting at the shelter for that perfect person to come, see him, fall in love, and take him home. This beautiful little girl is Ruby. Roby is five to six months old. She is a purebred boxer, uh, has just come in, and she will be spayed before she's adopted out. Obviously house trained, um, <laughs> obviously well raised, because she certainly loves people. This is a wonderful, sweet, friendly, loving, very active girl. She's, she's as, as sugar sweet as she can get. She's absolutely beautiful. I, you know, there's, there's not a whole lot I have to say to find a home for this one. If you know boxers, you know that they're great temperament dogs. And this girl is nothing less. If you know boxers, you know that they're loving. If you know puppies, you know that they're full of beans and energy. And she's nothing less. So if you're looking for a pup who is loving and sweet and outgoing and has had the beginnings of training, though she's still a baby and obviously ain't going to be perfect. If Yes, yeah, she is perfect. She's a perfect little ruby and she's looking for a home. This is the last dog we're gonna show you today. He is our special needs dog, only because he's 10 years old. Although his name is Bruin, and no one has ever told Bruin that he's 10. He thinks he's a puppy. He is active and playful and friendly. <laughs> Little stubby short legs and an absolutely beautiful face. He likes to cuddle. He likes to crawl in your lap. He loves to be held. He loves to be tossed around and played with. He just is an A number one first class people dog. And he has one strike against him and that strike is that he's been on this earth for 10 years. I venture to guess that anybody that comes out to adopt him has been on this earth for a lot longer. Um, he's got a long life ahead of him. Little dogs live longer than big dogs. Can't say for sure how many years this guy has got. Can only say for certain that he has lots of years, that he's healthy and he's playful and he's outgoing. This little guy would be a great kid's dog as well as an adult's dog. He simply loves everyone and everything. So if you look, can look past the calendar, if you can ignore the birthday and look at this wonderful, loving little guy, he's waiting. He needs a home. Don't pass him by. He's worth a look and a second look and a trip home. His name is Bruin. Safe Pet has some absolutely wonderful dogs, some absolutely glorious cats, kittens. Occasionally a puppy comes through, uh, but certainly young dogs are waiting here. Every one of them sweet, loving, kind, and caring. 
And every animal here is dependent on someone like you to offer that animal the forever home that he needs and the love that he needs. So if you have room in your heart, if you've got room in your home, please come out, see these loving guys, and take one home with you.